Hi, welcome to a short video on the practical usage of a software called Power BI Desktop. I'm Ashish Mathur and via this video, I'd like to show you the revenue flow from the different categories that this e-commerce company sells to the different sh shipping cities that the orders are shipped to via different order periods. So in the previous video of the same blog article, you would have actually seen um, the visuals and the analysis that we did within Excel itself using Power Pivot, Power Query and Power View. Now here I'd like to show you a completely different visual that's not available in Excel at all. Even in Excel 2016, it's not available as we speak. This is a custom visual that one has to create in a software called Power BI Desktop. So before I get into the software, just what exactly is this Power BI Desktop? Power BI Desktop is a free for download and use um, BI utility from Microsoft itself, which rolls all the four distinct BI tools into one, which is Power Pivot, Power Query, Power Map, and Power View. So all I've done is that from the Excel file, which I've generated uh, for the sales data modeling of an e-commerce company, I've simply imported that Excel file, including all the DAX formulas or the Power Pivot formulas that I've written into the Power BI desktop software. And here um, I've imported a custom visual free of cost from the Microsoft website called the SAN key diagram. So if I hover my mouse over here, you'll actually get to see there's something called a SAN key diagram, which I've downloaded free of cost from the Microsoft website. And I've tried to see the revenue flows using this diagram. So here's what it is. I have two different SAN key diagrams over here. One's, one shows me the categories on the left hand side with the order periods on the right hand side. The other one shows me the order periods on the left hand side and the shipping address city on the right hand side over here. Now what interpretation do I get from this? If I hover my mouse over a category, let's say DT, I'll get to know that a total of rupees 13.94 uh, units of goods were actually shipped of this category. Now, if I were to actually click on the 13.94 over here, you'll see that of all the people who ordered this particular category, none of them ordered this late in the night. All of them ordered this either in the morning, midday, evening, late evening, or in the night. And notice the moment I click on this, it automatically slices of cross filters my sand key diagram on the right hand side as well. So if I, let's say, just take my mouse over this specific one over here, you'll see that of all the, of the, of the 13.94 uh, uh, worth of goods that were ordered of this particular category, 3.543 of them were ordered during midday. If I hover my mouse over here, you'll see that's 3.43 and that's the breakup of where these orders are being shipped to. So the orders are being shipped to Bangalore, to Chennai, to different cities that I can actually see over here, Mumbai, so on and so forth. So each table talks to the other, each diagram talks to the other one over here. If I double click anywhere, I come back to the starting point. I click on evening over here and you'll see that of all the orders which were sh received during the evening period, which cities were they shipped to and which categories did they actually belong to. So this total is 51.78, which is the total of 51.78 here as well. Right, so I can see that the chunk of it is actually being ordered of this of, of the category called FS, which is 6.36. I can hover my mouse over each one of them to get to see what the breakup is. And what I also have over here are simple uh, column and uh, column and bar charts to to see how the interactivity works across different diagrams. So if I click on evening over here, you'll see this likewise filters my sand key tables here as well. So it's just a different way of visualizing data and different from what we normally do in Excel by creating a power uh, by creating our normal pivot charts or power view charts. It's a custom visual that is available only and only in Power BI Desktop. I hope you enjoyed watching the short video. Thank you.